good morning students i hope you all are fine and healthy let's start the new chapter chapter number 2 that is gui operating system desktop management part 1 video number 11 please take out your computer book and open the page number 12 now this is your chapter number 2 that is gui operating system desktop management in this chapter we have covered these topics that is operating system starting window 7 taskbar shortcut menu so let's start the first topic of this chapter that is operating system so what is a operate what is an operating system operating system is a program that control the overall activities of the computer as well as the operation of each and every part of it so that means operating system is a program and it control each and every activity of the computer as well as it control the hardware devices software devices each and everything controlled by operating system it recognize input from an input device such as a keyboard mouse scanners etc and display of output on the monitor instruct a printer how and when to print information and manages data and instruction in memory and information stored on a disk so that means operating system manage input devices output devices memory devices okay all other external devices also and operating system one of the function that is a start and restart the computer we call it as a booting also managed by operating system and the windows 7 is the most popularly used gui operating system developed by microsoft corporation so that means generally we can say that the operating system manage each and every action function activity of the computer and all the devices also managed by operating system now take out the page number 13 the topic is starting windows 7 Okay, so when we turn on our computer, Windows Seven start automatically, and we see a welcome screen. We may ask to enter the password. After a few seconds, we will get a desktop screen. So now this is the desktop screen. This one. Before getting further knowledge on Windows Seven, firstly familiarize uh, with the basic screen elements. so number one screen element is desktop icons these all are the desktop icons this one we call it as a desktop icons the small pictures on the desktop are referred to as the icons and every icon on a desktop represent a different program any icon can be opened by double clicking with mouse on it that means ki if we want to open the any icon just double click on it with the help of mouse now next is mouse pointer now this is a mouse pointer this one small arrow we call it as a mouse pointer it is a small arrow present on the desktop when we move our mouse this pointer move along with it in this way i move the mouse now the mouse pointer also move along with it next desktop screen this is the desktop screen this one this is the windows 7 work area it means that it is the place where we work with our program and documents now next date and time right side down corner this is the date and time option this one this show the current date and time on our computer next is taskbar this is the taskbar the long bar at the bottom of the desktop is a task bar next start button this one it is the most usable part of the desktop we can start program and can launch any of the windows features through the start button when we click on start button the start menu will appear in this way if i click on it with the help of mouse now the start menu will appear we call it as a start button next start menu it is used to assess that means if i click on start button the start menu will appear 
Now it is used to assess program files and computer setting. It's a left part shows all the programs. This one. And frequently used applications. It's a right part shows the shortcuts for various location on our computer and the shutdown button at the last and the shutdown button. So this is your topic starting Windows 7. Rest of the part of this chapter we will covered in next video. Thank you.